Yes, uh, when we fell. Is it impossible you, you let out a noise upon being hit? I think it's impossible that I let out a noise upon being hit because it was a very slow move. It wasn't an impact. The impact came when we fell on the ground. So it's very possible that when the impact was made, I screamed. But I do not recall making a sound until we were falling or on the ground. Okay. Would you have observed... First of all, did you personally look and see Mr. Sanderson? On the ground? After the event? Yes. And was he unconscious when you saw him? No. You said that you stuck around, mm -hmm. but while you stuck around, you never asked Mr. Sanderson if he was okay. Correct, because he had hit me and I was very upset. All right. You still didn't think it would be appropriate? to ask somebody if they're all right? Mr. Christensen asked if he was okay, and he said he was. Okay, meaning? Meaning Mr. Sanderson. I think you said that he mumbled it. He said, I'm okay. Okay. You were asked in your deposition, were you not, to your understanding, you're making a claim for the sum of $1 as a symbolic law, right? Yes. And you said, correct. Yes? That's right. And then I also asked you in your deposition, are you telling me now you're making a claim for more than the sum of a dollar? Do you remember what your response was? I don't remember. You said no. That's not the case, though, is it? Your Honor, this is... It's a yes or no. Move to... That's an improper question. She gave the answer. Overruled. It's a yes or no. Are you making a claim more than a dollar in this case. Now I am, yes. Thank you. No other questions. So, uh, Ms. Paltrow, the, the reason I got involved in this case in the first place was your counterclaim. Mm -hmm. So I want to talk with you about the counterclaim. Um, is it true that you feel it's unfair that Mr. Sanderson has brought this case against you? I do. Okay. And he has deterred you from enjoying the rest of what was a very expensive vacation. Well, I lost half a day of skiing. Uh -huh. Yes. Right. Okay. And um, I think that's that's what your counsel has argued as well that you lost a, you had a full day pass, but you can only ski a half a day. Yes, I went back down after lunch. Right, and that's when you had lunch and you got a massage? Yes. Okay. Um, didn't get your knee checked out, didn't have any kind of medical attention? No, it didn't feel acute in any way. It felt just like I had overstretched my knee and I had sustained a blow, but it didn't feel like it needed medical attention. Okay, and you're bringing this claim for $1. I am. Okay, in fact, your counsel, Steve, do you still have that dollar bill? That I'm not going to even respond to that. You, you, nah, I don't need it. Sure. Yeah, I don't need it. You saw Mr. Owens wave that $1 around, right? I did. Okay. $1 in symbolic damages. Is that accurate? It's an actual dollar that I'm asking for. Okay, but you also testified when I asked you questions in your deposition yes. that that $1 is symbolic. Do you remember me asking you it's about that? It's symbolic because the damages would actually be more. Okay. And, but remember me asking you, is it symbolic? And you said, yes, it is. Yes. Okay. And I asked you as well, well, you learned about that through Taylor Swift because she asked for $1 in symbolic damages, right? And I think I said at that point I had not been familiar with it, but I since am. Now you are. Yes. But at the time, a couple of years ago in 2020, you didn't know anything about Taylor Swift's $1 symbolic damage lawsuit? Just relevance, Your Honor. Counsel? Yeah, because I asked her about it at the time, and, and she, she denied it. Okay. Correct. Can you answer the question? Just relevance. I was not aware at the time. Okay. Are you good I, friends with Taylor Swift? No. Uh, the word symbolic was used, but did you in fact lose $1 or more as a result of the collision? I did. Uh, did did you hurt yourself? 
I'm sorry. Did Mr. Sanderson hurt you by hitting you? He did. And please explain. Well, when we fell over, my right knee felt like it had been overstretched and my back hurt. All right. And uh, you got a massage but did not seek medical care. Is that what I understand? I did not. 